morning. My name is uh, Philip Michaelis. I'm the CEO of Mindful Systems. We are providing solutions um, against landmines and other explosives. Uh, we offer a number of different platforms which can be configured to deal with a specific threat in a specific mine contaminated area. We are based in uh, Switzerland with a production site in Germany and offices around the world to be close to our customers. We're here at IDEX because um, the Middle East, North Africa is uh, one of the most important regions for us. There are a number of countries um, that are still suffering from, uh, from, from landmines and, and other remnants of war. Um, and consequently, uh, we're using IDEX as a platform to enter into a dialogue with uh, potential customers to, um, to uh, understand the requirements, to configure solutions. Uh, we're here also to showcase our latest product, the Micro Mine Wolf. It's the, the smallest mine clearance solution of its kind. It's been developed um, as a new platform, um, taking a lot of learnings from the platform we've provided in the past. Um, Mini Mindwolf, Medium Mindwolf, Mindwolf, um, just to name the other ones. Um, again, as with the other solutions, it can be configured to, to counter a specific threat. With that system here, we have the platform with a camera system. We have a so-called tiller attachment to uh, clear anti-personal mines, predominantly. This tiller attachment can be replaced with a robotic arm or even other devices to deal with, um, to deal with IDs, to deal with um, uh, bombs, um, any tasks which, uh, which put human beings into danger. We uh, have very good discussions here, so this show so far has been a success. We're currently active in more than 25 countries, among which are Afghanistan, Iraq, um, Jordan, Lebanon, uh, we're working with our machines in Somalia, in uh, South Sudan, Angola, DRC, Western Sahara. You see some of the countries that still face a significant mine threat. We not only provide the hardware, uh, it's very important for us to support the customer when implementing the machines. Um, the hardware alone doesn't do the job. Uh, we're providing training to locals normally um, to teach them how to operate the machine in a minefield using internationally recognized procedures to consequently uh, maximize the output of these machines because that's what they're made for, to clear square meters of contaminated land.